Ah, yes. Good, good. What's going on, YouTube? My name is Diesel, and today we're back. in satisfactory. Just watching these screws go into our assembler. We did have something where we had a splitter, and the splitter would take all of these things. So it would take all the plates, all the screws, and then we would merge them, and then they would split off into this. But instead, what I've done... Oh, I got nice little boots. Uh, what I instead is I removed the splitter and then made a direct line from plates to the assembler because what was happening was that the uh, splitter was merging plates and uh, bolts or screws because there's no like, I don't know, there's no filtering system where you can say like, I want this to go to the left, I want uh, bolts to go to this one, you know what I'm saying? So what we have to do is we just have the screws going in here. It breaks off to the right, goes into our storage here, along with plates and reinforced plates. This now goes into here. Uh, what was happening was is that this would fill up to a hundred plates, and then a hundred, uh, you know, a plate would try to go in either one of these things, and it would stop production just wholeheartedly. So now it doesn't stop production anymore. And whenever we fill fill up with screws, 120 per minute. So uh, usually a good time. Now what I've done to try and help out the production is we put an overclocker in here, and you know what? I'm just gonna go 150%. I'm be cranking out them screws, man. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be real good. Can't wait. Can't wait. Can't wait. So what are we doing today? These are well. We're in a hot mess right now. Well, I don't say hot mess. We just need a little bit more power. I want to get this rebar gun. It's gonna happen. We need some more reinforced plates. Which is fine. We have everything we need. Biomass. I already have biomass. Silly goose. But spiked rebar, rebar gun. And then that way we can move on to the next, which is going to be steel, steel beams, steel pipes, heavy modular frame, motors, st status, and encased industrial beams. This is going to be a mess. And it's also going to have a lot more power that comes along, or like power that's necessary. Ooh, Xeno Basher. Let's take the silver to that, to that jerk. So that jerk that killed me the other yeah yesterday. Storage. Oh, look at that storage container. It must be the double. It must be double. Uh. But we're gonna need this to make motors in order to make this anyway. So who cares? I like how the coffee. I didn't. It's the first time I'm recognizing the coffee cup. <laughs> Nifty. So, I have redone our copper system. I didn't like how it was. Wasn't a fan. This thing produces 60 per minute. Now our smelters, they do 30 per minute. So I'm actually pushing this a little bit, uh, it's pushing a little bit, to get the, the motion in the ocean. Because I'll tell you what, man, it doesn't seem to matter. It does not seem to matter. I tried, I'm trying to max out our, my math and my math skills ain't that great. So I got three smelters took out by the splitter. These two smelters will go one goes into a splitter, it goes to the left, goes to the right, but does not go anywhere else. So what we have here is a merger. Merger goes over into here. This is producing copper wire. Looks like we got 332 at the moment. And this is rolling out just A-OK, -okay, fancy, fancy, schmancy, fine and dandy. This is now going into the cables. The cables, they're producing 15 per minute as well. So it's like one for one, but it's just getting... It's just getting jammed. I may overclock this, but... I don't think I need to, because it's like we got we got cables for days, you know what I'm saying? Like, if this shuts down, it's no big... Th it's like no big deal to me, though. It's like no big deal to me, bro. And then we may just have to... Break this off and then split it over to here. We may have to get a splitter. Get a splitter, rock and roll out of it. So yeah. My math sucks. 45 per minute, so we have 90 going on both of the uh, smelters. And then, all three of the smelters, and then 45 per minute. So, the rate should be okay. The problem with this is, is that this is not going fast enough. Well, you would think it's going fast enough, but it's apparently it's not. It takes two wire. Oh, oh. It's one for one. This takes two wire. Oh. Oh, I wasn't aware. But this is all stacked up. And this is fine. We're almost we're almost full up on cables. I have so much cables I don't even know what to do with. But today, what we're gonna need for most of the new stuff 
It's coming out. We need more power. Now, we have 122 megawatts of power, but I'm tired of going out and getting all the biofuel for everything and then going to all my little mini stations and then filling it all up. So, as you can see, that stack right here. At the end of the last episode, I left you with a cliffhanger, like literally, because there's a coal node over there. And as you can see, I put another uh, coal, coal power, coal generator, which is what this jam is. So, we got this little opening right here. We're going to connect it to this once we start getting some, some, some copper, some copper, not copper, coal, some coal transported from one area to the next. Now we do have 74 coal to begin with, so I'm going to bring that with because we may need it to put, start our power and how we're going to keep this ever present, ever, ever going. It's going to be, what's the, uh, the time for, uh. Energy that just keeps on going at uh, ever present. Look at this station. This is fantastic. This is wunderbar. So, we've got a miner on top of the coal. We have the ramp. The ramp of doom over top of forever. It's terrifying, but necessary. So, I haven't even, I haven't even like, scoped out this area. There may be plenty of aliens over here, but... So, we got a miner. It's going out to there. We got this... Ramp going to a splitter. Splitter goes into the coal. So we got coal that's coming out of there. Now, what we're, whoa, whoa, whoa. Now what we're going to do is we are going to have coal go into our truck station. Which one's the innie and which one's the outie? Those are innies. No, those are outies. Let's have a... Can I... Oh. Hold on. Here, let's kind of, there we go. I just need you to go in there, sport. That's all I need for you to do. And you're gonna need fuel as well. Huh. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Well, <laughs> well then. What we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to connect this up, turn it on, and then we're gonna have to get our uh, well, we're gonna need a power. We're gonna need a power pole, for sure. So we'll do that. And this is just gonna power from here to here, from here to there, from there to you. All right. All right. And here we go. Oh, it's drilling stuff. Oh, look at that. It's the first time I'm actually noticing this. I love the animations in this game. They're the best. All right. Cool. She is splitting now. Beautiful things. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry. Ready, set. Fantastical. It's good stuff. And now, the coal mine, the coal mine will forever be powered because as long as it's keep making coal, since we had a little bit of coal to start off with, it's just gonna keep on filling it up. And look at that, 50 megawatts of pure, pure power. It's only consuming five. So far. Interesting. Interesting. So, now we need to make a path. Well, first we need to make a truck. Let's not get nuts. Or a tractor. Sorry. What do I need? Oh, I need beacons. Oh, no. I forgot the beacons. Up the ramp of, up the ramp of tomorrow. And I'm thinking about we're going to have to put walls on the side of this in order to, you know, not get uh, kicked off or have one of those things, one of those mothbird things, get confused and start taking swoops at our tractor. Do they do that in the game? I don't know, and I don't want to find out. All right. One, two, three, three. Fantastic. So, I technically can put this over here, but we're going to have most of the motion in the ocean is going to start over here at our little coal island.
It's a good brisk walk. It's good to get out, you know? Keeps you, you know, stay, it helps you stay in shape. Look at all that coal just, just filling up, piling up as far as the eye can see. And this is going to help power our station with our little trucking company that we have here. Look at that. It's already filled up with stacks. Fat stacks. Let's go ahead and pop this tractor down here. Yeah. It's beautiful. Awesome. Oh, it's got a little beeping. Oh, it's got a little horn. Oh, that's fantastic. Ah, here we go. So, hide path nodes. Start recording. All right. So we're going to start recording. It's going to go up this high pitch ramp. Can we make it? Oh no, 11? All right, we got, we're got we at 11 kilometers an hour. 10, we'll be fine. It's got a strong engine in it. I built it myself. And then up the ramp. Now don't give me stuff, aww. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. There we go. All right, we may need to do this again. Okay, so let's try this again. So C, start recording. Here we go. I think I can, 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 I know I can, I know I can, I know I can. We'll get there. We'll get there indeed. So that's going to be the loading. And then we're going to have this one I have set up for unloading. Now we just need to get a certain path, and I'm not quite sure how it goes. So let's go ahead. Up this little ramp. Up this little do wacky right here. You take that out. That's going to take there, in the goes, and then it's going to start packing up the coal. Now we're still recording. Three point turn. Down we go. All right, everyone put your hands up in the air. Roller coaster's going on. Woo! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Problems. Okay. That should work, right? <laughs> right. So now we gotta watch it. We gotta see what it does when I put this on autopilot. Enable autopilot. Okay, and there it goes. Okay. You can do it. I believe in you. Come on. Come on, just one more. One more step. One more ramp. Come on, you can do it. Look at motivation. <laughs> I'm that motivational coach, baby. Come on. You can do it. Don't quit. Don't quit. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So that's going to do its own thing. Look at that. Okay. 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 Takes it out of there. And then, and no one then. All right. I guess it's best to have just one straight stream so it's not like uh, you're doing any kind of like three point turns because it does take a little time. Or maybe just records every single last movement. That's just exactly how long it took me to do. This thing's going to crash right into this thing. It's going to be ridiculous. Whoa! That's going to be a problem. 
Yeah, that's a problem. That's a problem. We got nothing but problems over here. Oh my goodness. Okay, okay. Disable the autopilot. What have you done? <laughs> Whoops. I think I went maybe a little too fast down the ramp. Okay, so this thing is clunky at best. So even though I went down this uh, this path, this uh, ramp, at a slower speed at 20 kilometers an hour, just really taking my time, uh, the autopilot doesn't care. The autopilot goes goes full steam ahead down here, hits this ramp, and that's all she wrote. So what I might have to do is I might have to redo this here real quick. Just the way that this sits, because I may need to build a wall. Yep, sure am. That's exactly what I'll have to do. So, give me one second here. Alright, here she comes. Ooh. Bang! There we go! <laughs> Perfect. Drops it right in there. And out she goes. It works! <laughs> I put one wall here. I was trying to put two walls here, but it uh, apparently is encroaching on somebody else's shenanigans, and I don't know what it is. Uh, even with all of these conveyor belts moved, it still says that it's got some sort of issue right here. And, of course, right here, because this is here. But, like, I think this will work out just fine. I just needed one wall to stop, to stop the man from going from crazy town. Now, we may put one of these let's just put these up I just want to move out of the way just in case I'm about to get run over and this way we can have nice little sections so this way if he hits this it's not going to fall off the edge and then fall into the dark dark forever the dark forever no I don't want you to scan don't want you to scan I just want to see this one more time if it works two times that means it'll work every time right 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 uh, uh? is that a cave well, I'll be darned. It sure is. Oh, here he comes. Bang! <laughs> whoa, 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 sport. Boom. It, lo it, it bounces off perfectly and loads it up for him. I'm telling you, man. It's like I planned to do it this way. Well, that's fantastic. All right, now. Ready, set. Steel production is eminent. Some rotors. We'll get some frames. Get some cables. More cables. Oh, sorry, wire. Now we'll put in the cables. Ready, set, and launch. Yes, yes. Milestone reached. Steel production unlocked. Foundry and improved miner included to ensure efficiency of new pipelines. A collection of new, more complex parts is now available for crafting. Great, more complex parts. Just what we need. More math. Alright, so what do we have now? We have the Miner MK2! Beautiful. 120 resources per minute, so it do blaze the output. Foundry. Smelts two resources into alloy ingots can be automated by feeding ore into it with a conveyor. So this might be pretty nifty because we can take our reinforce. I think actually I lie. It's not going to be nifty at all. We need to take reinforced plates. Uh, need to take reinforced plates with is it steel? With a, an, an iron ingot, and then that will make steel. Now we actually have an iron node over here that I have not done anything with. Ooh, hold on a second. There's an iron node somewhere over here which I have not touched. So I believe so. I believe it's over here. Seeing through rocks. I have extra. I have, I, I, have, I have the sight. I have the sight. Green power slug. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Where is that node at? I think it might be over where the copper was. But I have another iron node. Now that smelter to make steel. I'm not quite sure. But I believe it'll take... Yes, right there. So, bang and rang. 
And we also have one of these. We got two of them. Oh my god. We got two nodes here of beautiful, delicious iron. As far as the eye can see. So we may have to we'll have to make an expansion. We'll have to connect this. Let's start making that with the MK2. Now let's see just what it's going to take to make steel. Because I don't know. Let's see here. Whee! Alright. Steel ingots. Iron ore and coal. Really? Hmm. That may be an issue. Well then, iron ore and coal. Uh, maybe uh, maybe it's going to be fine. I have a feeling it might be fine. Because how much is this stuff? Is we, are we, are we actually... Hold on here. This is really going to bug me. Foundations. There we go. Oh, hold on. It's not done yet. Not done. Not done. Boom. What? So, if we run a conveyor system from these iron... Oh, yeah. We can knock that iron node out. Bring a conveyor system over to this section over here. Over here. And start making steel from iron production. So, we got iron... We'll have coal coming out of here, because look at it. I mean, even though we have 155 megawatts of power, it just fluctuates, because I think we are starting to run low on our biofuel. So I may need... How much is this stocking up, though? Power forever. Oh, yeah. So we have plenty of coal, man. So I have a feeling that we may need to make another one of these jams right here to just kind of power everything up. And then we'll take the coal... I'll have, get a uh, I'll get a a miner, probably just an MK1, at the moment. We could always replace it, and then bring it over here, and we'll start assembling some steel. Yes, some blue steel. No, I'm just playing. Seriously, it's gonna be a good time. And then we'll start rocking out into uh, trying to get these tiers situated here. Whoa, whoa. Let's see here, microphone, tier two, jump pads. And some of these lower end type things, I'm just going to knock out. Just be like, we're done. We're done with you. <clears throat> I'm done with you. I'm done with you and I don't need you anymore. Jump pads. And this way we'll just knock out the tier 2 and not have to worry about that specific hub upgrade. But folks, that is going to be the episode for today. We got, our, we, got our, we got our tractor. It's doing this automated thing. We got plans. We're building some more stuff. We're trying to assemble some things. And get everything rock and rolling and make it look nice. So, we got storage we got to worry about soon. And we're going to make steel in the next episode. But folks, if you enjoyed this video, by all means, hit that like button. Helps out my channel ever so much more than you know. And if you like it a whole lot, go ahead and hit subscribe. New videos are coming out every single day, every single week. Folks, have a great day, afternoon, evening, a good night. Peace out, like shout, y'all. And I will check you out right here again. In Satisfactory. Next time. Oh, this works out just fine. You're doing a good job, buddy. You're doing a real fine, fine job.